You're probably going to find there are a lot of parties between now and the end of the year, and you kind of have to watch what you're eating. So Rose Reisman is here with two of the losers to help us figure out what to pick. Maybe what to have one of yeah. and what to, you know, really have you fun got it. with. And Tracy, from now till January, actually from Thanksgiving till January, we gain, we can gain anywhere from three to five pounds. And we right. know how easy it is. And then we have that same New Year's resolution. So I'll be back in New Year's telling you how to lose it. But here's a couple little tips because we're all going to be at these parties and these foods circulate like crazy. The appetizers, so, so the first holiday of all, appetizers. I, I picked some things from M&M's because these are great. They're frozen. People love it. It's quick and easy. Right. So puff pastry with brie cheese and a little bit a strawberry. Now, first of all, puff pastry, every layer has got butter, sometimes lard, depends on, you know, what you have, but that's what makes it rise. It's the butter that heats to a boiling, uh -huh. rises it, so you're going to end up rising like one of these little puff pastries if you keep <laughs> eating those. So six of these guys are 400 calories and 24 grams of fat. Keep in mind, we should have 1,500 calories a day. Now, this is what I love. Yeah, that is not a meal. 400 not calories a meal. And should you know be a meal. And you know easy it is to just, you know, and I always say location, location, when you're at the buffet, you keep, stay away from the table, like start yeah. to wander away. Go stand somewhere else. All right, equivalent to 23 pieces of sushi That's a in lot terms of, sushi. of fat. And this is with the crab meat and avocado. Yeah. You could eat all of this for those six. But instead, believe it or not, the little spring rolls, even though they are deep fried, so I'm not taking away all the joy, but the, the, the wrappers are just made with flour and water. There's no oil or lard in them. These come in at 240 calories, yeah. 7.5 grams of fat versus the 424 grams. Much better. Way better. You know, and you're, you're not saying don't eat it. Absolutely. You're just saying, you know, try and eat more of those. More then. of those. And the puff paste, you just remember that when you're having the puff paste. Yeah, I didn't realize that about puff yeah, pastry, huge. actually. All right. Okay, so now shrimp. So, coconut shrimp. So coconut shrimp, breaded. Deep it's fried. So good. It's so good. Four of these are 260 calories, uh -huh. 16 grams of fat. Equivalent to, you could get these little rings like in all the supermarkets, yeah. to one and a half of these rings in terms of calories for those four shrimp. And shrimp by themselves are delicious. Yeah. But instead, go for the grilled or the sauteed shrimp where five of these come in at 60 calories and only a half a gram of fat. Better. Look at the difference when you deep fry. Yeah, that is way okay. better. So try and stay away from the deep fry. Yeah. And if you eat oh all of this God. at the party, you're not going to have any friends. Okay, all right. You got That's it. A lot. You got it. It's a lot. And I have to tell you, when I was back there now, I was hungry, and I ate about half of these, and like I put in 10, 15 calories. That's it. Yeah. So nibble away on the great, yeah. you know, boiler Don't eat speed. them all, though. Don't eat them That's all. That's going to be a bad look. All right. So now this is the newest thing up by President's Choice. These yeah. are little chicken lollipops. Coconut chicken so, lollipops. Yeah. So oh, these are, I, I believe. I mean, that sounds good. It sounds good. It's probably really bad, isn't we it? We know. All okay. right. So the minute we, it's chicken thigh, it's dark meat, it's coconut, it's deep fried, and it's battered. Yeah. Woo! Four of these. 360 calories. Oh my. 18 grams of fat. You could enjoy three grams. quarters of a McCain's cheese pizza with chicken for these four. So, what I, I like to show this because it really puts it in perspective that you could have this as your meal as opposed to these four. But believe it or not, wings! My son was so excited when he said, Mommy, you're saying okay to wings. Yeah. Four wings, but you want to get the salt and pepper, not the fried. Not the crusty, not the crunchy. Okay. All right. So these guys come in at 200 calories and 12 grams of fat. Oh, much so, better. So I'm, I'm not telling you you have to eat crudités, right? Right. Yeah. Okay. You can actually have some chicken wings. You can. That's a good deal. And now desserts. Okay, now desserts. So little single desserts. I always believe in having some dessert, but again, be careful. Yeah. This innocent little guy here, this is a beautiful sticky pudding. Oh, you remember man. that? It's made with usually dates and caramel and butter. Toffee. The sauce, the toffees all around mm -hmm. it. 490 <gasps> calories. I don't think you're worth it. No, you're not. 19 grams of pizza. fat. Same here. Mm -hmm. And that's because there's caramel, butter, cream. It is so good. The two came in a package, so I had to try I'm it. I'm getting mixed sure. messages right now. Okay. okay. <laughs> I'm sure that tastes amazing. It but you always does. have to be balancing. You've got to be balancing. Is it worth it, or do I want right. to have more of a, a bad meal and no dessert, or right. maybe a good meal and some dessert? You got it. It's and, always that balance. And that's why right? when January 1st comes and you get on that scale and you see, oh, I'm up five pounds. You kind of know that, you know, three of those is your day intake. Maybe it wasn't intake. good. So equivalent to, I love this, Ew. the butterscotch, <laughs> 12 and a half butterscotch puddings, okay, uh. in terms of fat for that. That's that, gross. But it is gross, and I want people... I, just and, I don't like butterscotch pudding, so okay. for me, it's like, ew, I'm never having that. And Tracy, you <laughs> I know, I, I hate... I don't know how this will come up, but I like to be gross, because it shows you just... 
you you that's what you said yeah. oh my god I wouldn't do that yeah that's what you're doing when you consume one of these right instead tiramisu is He's that not bad for you? Choice. Do you know what? There is whipping cream in it. There's sponge cake, but believe it or not, this comes in at 270 calories, 14 grams of fat versus almost the 519 grams. Very cool. So a choice. You know, you don't yeah. want just strawberries. Have a little tiramisu, and better yet, take this with three forks and you and your friends nibble away at yeah, it. Yeah, that whole sharing thing. I got to start trying that. That's really good. <laughs> <laughs> I know people I'm usually more go like, don't I don't want, touch don't my dessert touch with my, my dessert. dessert. I make like a gate, like Got a it. fence. Don't get closer. What you do at Glow is very smart, though, because yeah. you offer desserts, but they're in little shot glasses. Shot glass desserts. And what you find is yeah. sometimes all you need is a little bit of sweet at the end of your meal. Oh, like, I goodness. like to have a little bit of sweet, yeah. but you don't necessarily need the whole slice. Well, I'm shocked because they, they come in like this little shot glass desserts and everything from Rocky Road they're to so good. white chocolate. They're so 120 to 160 calories. And as you finish half of it, the sweet has touched your, t your taste buds. You feel good. And when you finish it, you go, you know what? That was enough. That was enough. But here when you have this, it's so innocent looking, you're going to finish the whole right. thing. Right. Absolutely. Rose, thank so you. Happy holidays.